Look at the book. Hello, it's me too. Welcome back to Let's Play Odin Spear. Where last time, Gwendolyn went and saved her hubby. And we're gonna just take a look at what's going on in the story today. You know, we're gonna have So Crates help us out. See uh, where we are in the, j the drama right now. We've gotta skip ahead a little bit. But uh, yeah, everything's pretty much just straightforward from now on. Uh, we're, we're heading into chapter 6 today, so that will be fun. I mean, what events could possibly ha lead, you know, happen to lead to this occurring? And let us go. Chapter 6, The Old Castle Terrace. <sighs> well, we're back, and aw, poor Oswald. He's in bed, and man, he looks like, he looks awful. Oswald is safe. What a relief. Yeah, good to see you say her. Yes, indeed. Man, he looks awful. You mustn't. Don't go anywhere without telling me ever again. But in any event, I too am happy to hear of Oswald's return. I'm very glad that he's safe as well. What do you have to sell, Mr. Puka? I'm glad that your husband is safe, Princess. Well, uh, what do we got to buy? Well, we don't really have much. We just bought everything we care to buy. Uh, let me just take a look at my inventory real quick. Uh, yeah, we're pretty good on items, really. Yeah, we're good. Actually, I may want to buy, like, one. Yeah, I'll buy one material, because I am a little ahead on my money. And honestly, after this point, we really... There's only, like, one more thing in the game to buy. So... Yeah, we're really just going to be going to get to what Brom said, and we're going to see what's going to happen, where we head off to next. Well, we are going to Ringford Forest of the Fairies. Ooh, that's a giant tree stump. Well, let's see what's going to happen. I mean, why would we go here? We'll find out today. Has Oswald's condition changed? He is resting That's at awful. the moment. I see. May I ask you something? What is it? I have heard rumors suggesting that Oswald has some type of connection to the Queen of Death. Well, he is a Shadow Knight. Um, hmm. In order to increase my Belder Reaver's power. My father's sword. What? Oswald! You Dude, need to rest. That sucks. And just as he wished, I acquired the curse Man, of Man, your dad's an asshole. Light. But in compensation for this contract, the Holia lurk about everywhere. They are waiting for the Servants moment of my Death power to take his life. How that terrible. is terrible, Gwendolyn. As long as I have the Belder Reaver. The Halia fear me and stay away. But this power continues to be my curse. That was a close call back there. I must thank you. But, Gwendolyn, why did you go to the well, Obviously, to save you. What did you discuss with Onyx? I apologize for not obeying your command to stay here. But... I was so worried and concerned about you. I could not sit idly by. Huh? You were worried. Aww, about me. look at her blush. I, she actually does um, like him. Your Highness. Oh, Valkyrie. You belong to my father's troops. What's going on? I have something to report. Ragnarnival suffered a crushing defeat from the Veneer. Oh no! The they have seized the area around the cauldron. That can't be. How is the king? Is the king all right? King Odin has been wounded by Yee. arcane bolts and has returned That's to the castle. That's not good. But his injuries are severe, and he is in no shape to do battle. 
The enemy will surely take this opportunity to invade the castle. The precious ring he received from your oh, Highness. What? Why are you saying that? Oh no. You gave away the ring I Dick move. I think he just broke his heart. No. This was all part of the Demon Lord's scheme. So I was used as a puppet. Wait a moment. Oh, I really He doesn't deserve <sighs> that. Your Highness, for now, please return to the kingdom and assist King Odin. I cannot return to my father, but I will serve my responsibility as the king's daughter and fight. Please inform the king of my intentions. storm the castle. You storm the forest. Yep, that sounds like what she's gonna do. Well, I hope you're ready, guys. Because, uh, this is gonna be quite the fight. Oh, hey, Bluebird. What are you doing? You're going to attack alone? You're asking to be killed. If I can retrieve that ring, the entire it world will. will change. Are you doing this for your father? Nah, uh, she's doing it for Oswald. Or for him. I never imagined losing someone could be so terrifying. I don't want to lose him. That's why she's trying to right the wrongs that she made. Very good of her to do that. So welcome to Ringford Force. I gotta say, this place probably has uh, one of my favorite themes. Like, just for stage themes and such. Ah, I love the music here. It's so good. Come on, book. Now, this area does have a lot of the same enemies that we fought earlier in the game. Uh, from the veneer. So, pay attention to that. Yeah, it's got a nice little force here. So we gotta reclaim the ring from the queen. We're good. So what do we got? Uh, I think you can... this place has, if I remember correctly, I think this place has a lot of the similar Mandragoras from the force. So that is something to keep, you know, keep a look for. I think this is a good place to get onions, but you can't really, I, if I remember correctly, you can't actually return here with Gwendolyn. If I'm remembering correctly, you might be able to. But I don't really see a reason to come back afterwards. So we got a bunch of seeds. Very nice. Now let me see. I bought that material, so I'm gonna fuse off some stuff. Ah, uh, material zero. This is why I have you. I wanna fuse the seed off because I wanna make a nine. If I can. Actually, no, I'll make a ten with this because I have a warmer, don't I? Where is it? I do have a warmer, no, a cooler, right? Wait, hold on, let me see. Do we have a cooler? We do not. That That's fine, though. I don't mind. Just take these seeds, fuse them off one by one, and refine my material. Yeah. We, uh, Gwendolyn's very close to, well, she's not really, re um, I'm trying to think if she's close or not. Because Gwendolyn actually learns her final spell kind of late. I think she, her, like, her spell's, like, the latest that you can get a spell for a character. So, pay attention to, uh, to Gwendolyn. Gwendolyn's level. I think it's, I think she learns her last spell level 37. It might be level 38. So, you know, make as many materials as you can. You know, just try to use those up. Ooh, character here. I would like to pick up some characters as well. They are fairly calm. Well, no, they're like the, uh, I think it's kind of the same encounter rate. Gladly, there is no terrain, uh, both neg negatives, like, they don't drain your HP here. Which I like. And I will plant the, yeah, I'll plant this mulberry. Now, obviously, since we're in the fairy forest, we're gonna be fighting a bunch of these freaking elf fairies with the bows and the arrows, and they're gonna be kind of annoying. Just be, you know, just walk past them, 
pretty much counter him like that. Boom! Mmm! Nice! Just try to absorb those photons as much as possible. Um, I would like to get some rotten fruit if possible. So, uh, yeah, we got an S rank, which is very nice. And we'll just break that open. Ooh, I think that's the map. Oh, no, it's just a new recipe, chocolate. Eh, it's not that useful. Okay, so they both grow. Do I have any run for it? That's the question. I do need more health tonics, so I'm probably just going to use that for it. Uh, let me see. Well, first off, I want to fuse... Yeah, let's fuse this 90. This nap seed. Gold, silver, silver, gold, ready, go. Okay, so we'll do that. So we got a 91 going. I would like to get a 94 if possible. Because that's how, uh, that's how you make that's how you make health tonics with Ron Poo. Yeah, this will be very nice. Cause uh yeah, we do want some health tonics, guys. Don't don't be cocky and think, oh I don't need no health tonic, you know, I have HP for days. No, you, you definitely want to have you know health tonics on hand if possible. And you, <sighs> Sometimes you can't grab enemies' items, but you can always hit them, which I think is a nice feature. Come on. You gonna, you gonna break for me? Well, I might as well organize my bag while I'm at it. Just uh, move these onions over. Wait for that. I do actually move that cuzbane over. I don't really need the halibaristos anymore, so I can probably fuse those off as soon as possible. And now we just gotta wait for the fruit to burn off. Yay, we're flying, we're flying. Do, 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 do. I like how we're actually gaining altitude. That's pretty great. Uh, okay, there we go. So they wiped off. Very nice. If I remember correctly, this is a shop. And. Yep, it is. You can tell because the music is all jazzy and do business with the nice and reflective. Here. And hey, we this got a puka. Has been unsafe lately. You do? Well, yeah, it's because people are storming it like crazy. And listen, we got the sun pendant. I think. Yeah, we got the Mars. I'm not interested in those. I might buy another material though. I just feel like buying stuff today. Uh, trust me, I have enough gold. For what I want to buy later. And let's just see if there's anyone else I want to talk to. Nope. So let's continue onwards to fight more fairy enemies. Yeah, I do like this theme that's playing though, when there's no enemies around. It's a very quaint theme. And obviously, since we are in the veneer territory, we're gonna be fighting the paladins from earlier in the game, you know, the unicorn guys. Alright. Ooh, I did not mean to do that. Wait for it. Wait for it. Let's do that. Combo his combo his rear. Actually I should hold on. Can do I need to use bows on first? Uh no. I don't actually yeah, I'll use it because there's an enemy behind me. Oh! Wait for it. Woo! Very nice. So with the on as possible. Just, uh, yeah, just be patient. Yeah, patient. Yeah, be patient and don't really worry about it too much. We won't need to... Uh... The Paladins aren't too hard. Hmm. Very nice. Pay for it. Do a combo. He stops right in dead in his tracks. And we get a useless critical. Ah, don't you just love useless criticals, guys? Ooh, what? What's that? What's that? What did he drop? Is that what I think? Oh my God! Are you kidding me? He dropped an unlimited pow. Oh, oh God, yes! Oh my God, yes! 
Oh, the gods have shined on me today. <laughs> okay. So that item, as the name would suggest, makes it so that you have unlimited pow... Like, your pow gauge does not run out for a short amount of time. Oh, my god. Are you kidding me, game? <laughs> now, here's the thing. Unlimited POWs are, like, probably in the... Are easily the best one of the best items in the game. You know, it lets you make all. It, ah, I can't talk because of how awesome it is. It's easily one of my favorite items in the game by far. Oh, it's beautiful. Like you have no idea how awesome the unlimited power is, and we don't actually need hub resources anymore on Wendland's bulk anymore, at least. Actually, I might keep one. Mm, no. Yeah, I want to keep one at least. Just for later. Uh, yeah. I don't want to use the limited pow. No, 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 no. Those are way too good. That actually saves me uh, some grinding later. So, that's very nice. Because uh, we will be need. We will be needing that unlimited pow for later. It is a. Is quite the useful item to have. Uh, let me see. Yeah, I'm just gonna do that, and I'm just gonna use clothes on release. Is uh, I want to get that. I want to get some health back too. Is that enough? So I would like to fuse it off if possible. Come on, I'm so close. You know, I'll do one more clothes on release just in case. Oh. There we go. Just absorb the rest. And pop that off. There we go. Got a muggle. Very nice. Yeah, it's not really worth that much, but... We can fuse it off to make another 9. Which will be very useful. Because I want to get some 10s going. And I could very much fuse this one off. Well, that... Ooh, yeah, I can sell that map to see it off. Boom! Get a 10. Gonna do some more math. Gonna make a 90. Very nice. I'll take that. Check my inventory real quick. Because I want to put that away. Seriously, I did not think I'd be... I'd get a freaking... Unlimited POW. That... That is just absurd. I... I'm so... Br like... You have no idea how rare those things are. I didn't even know that the freaking Paladins dropped that. It's just that rare that they do that. If I remember correctly, I think this is also a shop, or it leads to a shop. No, no, it's a, another stage. Alright, what do we got here? We have Onion! I should probably make some uh, Napalm soon. Because I don't think we have any. Oh! Oh, we got the healing chicks! Get out! Get out of my house! Die! Ugh, I hate these stupid freaking mages. Oh, what did you drop? Oh, good. More aerial coins. That could have been done so much better. Oh, there's more enemies. In fact, I'm actually going to throw a, a cyclone up. Just because there are, that, there are so many enemies in this direction. Oh, I can't let them heal themselves, though. And we'll just absorb the rest of the bosons, because, you know, it's pretty easy. Yeah, that could have been done a little better on my part. But hey, we still get the really good time bonus. And we managed to get a B-rank, which I like. And boom, gotta open that. Get a coin. We get Alchemy Mix B, which is actually one of my favorite alchemy mixes in the game. It allows you to make the almighty blizzard item. Now, I haven't actually shown off the blizzard item yet, but that's just because it's it's so good that I don't want to use it. And I did and I kind of wanted to wait until this point to actually get one. So, let me think. Well, I can drop this and I can take that 10. 
just check my items. Yeah, blizzards require cups veins, though, and those are kind of rare, like in the normal play. I know that I've got a few of them, but you definitely... like. I don't want to use it right now, because they're more useful in the uh, next state, well, the next area that we go to. Trust me, the blizzard will be just ridiculous in the next part of the game. Ouch. Uh, this... This is probably the five-star stage, so I might use it. I'll just wait for, like, legions of enemies to come. Oh! Ooh, come at me! Mm. Oh! Oh, crap! Yeah, I kind of expected that. I think I'm... Okay, I'll actually use the blizzard now. Hope you guys are gonna see... Well, you guys are gonna see one of the best items in the game now, so... Yeah, that's nice. Yeah, this is probably the five-star stage. Just, uh, you know, just nod your head up and down, just wait for these guys to come. Because the blizzard will run out if you use it improperly. So blizzard, it casts the freeze status ailment. But it's not just like a little throwy, I am. No. It right out summons a blizzard. And these guys, yeah, look at that. Look at that, we just froze all those enemies up. In fact, I'm actually going to use overload to capitalize on this. Yeah, look at that damage that we're doing. And they're just all staying in one place. It's so fantastic. Look at that. Hold on, yeah. Did I break those? Yeah, I did. Ah, yes! Mm. Look at how many enemies were just, like, annihilating in one fell swoop. Holy crap. And these guys have a lot of chests. The nice thing is that the free status helmet lasts... For anyone... Is... Yeah, look at that. They're still frozen after that. And is this the five... Yeah, yep, 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 it is. Wait for these guys to get all together. And... Boson Burst. Mm! Oh, God, yes. That. That is what we call an S rank. I hope. We got the time boot bonus, definitely. We didn't take any damage, so yeah, we got an S rank on the five-star stage. That is pretty good. You know... And let's see, is that what I think it is? Nope, it's just another recipe. But this is for Kamisan, which is another re you know, recipe you could make, but I don't find it that useful myself. I guess one, again, once you've gone with uh, onion salad and another recipe you get later in the game, it's kind of hard to go back. In fact, I'm actually going to plant this rose mile as well, because I don't want to use my posons quite yet. Grow, my pretties, grow. Or I want more posons. Um, let me actually move. Ah, oh, man, I, I'm so, I have so many napalms. I should probably use more of those. Uh, come on, come on, grow, darn it. Yeah, this is a reward seed. I kind of mentioned this earlier, but they require way too many bosons to make. They're pretty much only good if you want to cook them. So, you know, you gotta plant those to all make them work. And, yeah, let's just absorb the rest of those bosons. I don't really plan on uh, making these rotten, because I'm just gonna fuse them off anyway. Gotta make that material 90, guys. Uh, yeah, fuse that off. Then just pretty much fuse all my junk off. I don't need that one anymore. I don't need the uh, reward seed, because I'm pretty much good on money for the rest of the game. Do I want to fuse off one of my... Well, I can fuse these mulberry seeds out of my bag in this rose pile, so... I'm good. Yeah, let's fuse that one off. I can keep that rose mile... That, uh, not rose mile, but... I don't think I need the rose mile after this. So... Yeah, I'll just fuse that one off. Take nine. Fuse that off. Make ninety. I know this preparation may seem crazy, but trust me, material nineties are way too good. Uh, yeah. Let's just put that over here. Uh, yeah. Let's put this fruit. I would like to make another blizzard though, because blizzards blizzards are just ridiculous. See if there are any uh, guys around here that I can. Got a little ninja dragger over here. 
Ooh, care tier. I like that. I could totally make it a... Uh... Yeah. Oh, yeah, that was the five-star stage. Man, that was pretty good on my part. Ah, so quaint with the music here. I could make the... Na na you know what? Screw it. I will make the 98. Not. I'm not going to fuse it off right now, but I just fuse off that one berry first. We don't quite have all the stuff for this area. We don't have the map yet, and I'm pretty sure the map is in the middle. This should be in the map, if I'm remembering correctly. Here we got another Mandragora. Another Caratier, very nice. One of mine a Cuzbane, actually. So I can show, use the Blizzard more often. In fact, I don't, you know, I have the Napalm, so I might as well use it. <laughs> yeah, I would say that the, uh, the napalms are the best item, but they're kind of. Because, like, the thing with Blizzard is that even though it's so crippling, a lot of enemies are resistant to it. And most bosses don't actually take damage. They take, like, a little damage at the start of the battle, but they doesn't actually freeze the boss. It works well on some mid-bosses, especially in uh, one of the areas later in the game. We got Chocolate Fondant. Very nice. Pure Cocoa. You know, we can do that, but I don't see, I don't think that's too necessary. More care tiers. Nice. I would actually like to uh, use off. Now, I'm trying to think, is it a 92? Is it 90 or 92 that I'm looking for? Well, let's actually check. We want to make a painkiller and I think, yeah, that is a 92 with a care tier. So let's just fuse it off real quick. Fuse the mulberry. Now, the nice thing right here is we got pure cocoa. It's actually a really good healing item for this point of the game. So if you don't feel like using away like a bunch of stuff just to make one, you know, you can do that. Now let's go ahead and uh, make that painkiller. Painkillers are super good. And, uh...